welcome to River Place. I'm so glad you're here. Oh, I am so excited to be here. Awesome, let's go check it out. Okay, sounds great. I'm here with Julie, our PTA president. Can you tell me about what our program is doing this morning and why? Yes, so we started Run Club a couple years ago as a way to team up with our teachers. We give them a little bit of extra time in their classroom alone doing teacher planning. And while that's happening, the kids are able to come out on our track. They can walk, they can run, they can also, if they're not in the mood, sit in our gym and read quietly. It's a great way to start your body, just kind of moving around before a big day of learning and it's been great. Keep running, keep running. And then the kids are able to earn miles. So we have the parents also tracking them. Once they get to a certain mileage, they get a prize, which is, of course, incentive. So I've had so many questions about how can parents get involved in campuses? This sounds like a great this way. This is the perfect way because you can come with your kid in the morning, park your car, enjoy your coffee while they're running. <laughs> And it's over by the time school starts, right? So it's kind of over around 7.45 and then you can get back in your car and hop over to the office or whatever you have going on that morning. So we, we really encourage it for those parents that kind of struggle to be able to get involved. It's a nice, short, but very impactful way. At River Place Elementary, we're so thankful to have our watchdog program back in place. So tell us a little bit of what you enjoy about watchdogs. Um, this is my first time doing it. Uh, my son is in kindergarten here. Um, I was just curious what goes, get a better idea of what was going on at the school, meet the people that he's interacting with and the names he mentions at home. Um, I just wanted to get more involved in the school and help out. Well, there is so much going on on campus. I love seeing all the kids engage and involved. Tell me about what's going on in this classroom. So in Mr. Averitt's class today, they're going to be talking about what a president should be. They're in their social studies block right now, and so they'll be writing in their journals. Can you tell me why you think the president should be smart? I think he should be smart because if he isn't smart, then all of the citizens can't make rules and then people can do whatever they want. And then, and then it would be really bad, so I think he should be smart. At River Place, we put a lot of value in our feeder and making sure that our students are talking to not just our middle school students, but also our high school students. In action in this room is going to be our PALS program, where Vandergrift High School students work with our Titans. Perfect. High five. Yeah, I did it. We are here with Stella. Stella, you are joining us on campus because you're part of Literacy Partners. Can you tell us a bit about the program? Yes, the program's amazing. It's through Education Connection. And uh, there are 750 volunteers serving a number of school districts. We always need more volunteers. The main thing is, is coaching a child, uh, wanting them to read and be happy about books. And so this is a perfect program for that. It can be extremely, extremely cold up, up in the mountain. And we know literacy by third grade is so essential. It is. The children that I'm working with here have just grown by leaps and bounds because there's a really strong reading program here. But it's so much fun to come once a week and stay for about 45 minutes with each child. You read uh, to them sometimes. Uh, one of my students really enjoys reading to me, so I don't read as much, I listen a lot, and break down words, and we just have a really good time. Well, I have had so much fun touring your campus today. Oh, I'm so glad you're able to make it out. Thanks so much. Yes, and seeing impactful family engagement happening in so many places, right? Whether it's the uh, literacy partners or our running program, you have a lot going on on campus. Yes, we do, and we're so blessed to be here. And I'm so glad to have a community that serves so well. So thanks again for coming out to see us in action because it's truly a blessing to serve here every day. And I'm really glad that you got to see a chance how we're building pride here on our campus. So thanks so much again, Trish, and I hope to see you again soon. Awesome, thank you.